accelerate coming at you from the mountain, well, the brushy mountain. I was going to say mountain of Taylorsville, North Carolina, but this probably isn't really a mountain. Pretty cool single track though. So, shortcut. Oh yeah, into the butthole. spectating and spectating battle of the goats and man we got to see some really cool action so this weekend I am back at Brushy Mountain to ride and not only to just ride some single track and some trails but also to participate in Meg's Brap uh, riding clinic so I gotta give a shout out to Girls Ride NC that made all that happen. So, very cool ladies. The ladies got to ride uh, the clinic. They did a clinic Friday, and then they're actually doing a clinic right now as well. So, and then Sunday, Megs was here and then she opened it up um, to basically everyone uh, guys and gals and uh, as you can tell it's it's pretty pretty muddy but I'll tell you the, the Ibex knows no bounds this is some serious shit right here I should have went right I don't know if I got the startup traction or not I think to the right there is the easy line one thing about the Yamaha is that it's so tall whenever I get in real dicey situations uh, it's so tall so you know in the beta I'd be more inclined to take that left line uh, this guy here probably not so much but um, the guy to the right, it seems like the easier path that most people are riding. But uh, yeah, this is some pretty, pretty hairy stuff here. Pretty sweet. But in any case, uh, yeah, we're here for this clinic. And uh, yeah, we'll see how the weekend goes. I'm going to do some more riding and uh, you know, we'll we'll see if the clinic uh, is a good time. I think it will be. So enjoy as I try not to kill myself on Trail 9C here at Brushy Mountain. <sighs> Made it.
Alright guys, that wraps up the Meg's Brap Clinic at Brushy Mountain. I gotta say, it was a fantastic time. Uh, I think it was well worth the time and money um, from a skill development standpoint. Um, one thing I didn't mention in the beginning was this was the uh, intermediate novice class. So this is kind of uh, Meg's level one. She does do a level two. Um, which we're hoping to uh, possibly get get after here this uh, late summer, maybe maybe fall. But uh, you know, a lot of people say that one way to definitely advance your skills is to get some coaching, and I'm, I'm a firm believer in it. You know, I went riding after the clinic and uh, back on Trail 9C, and <laughs> I, it felt different. I have to admit, all the static balance and the um, drills that we were doing and the tips that we were getting throughout the day it made oh, a difference man. and uh, you know I carry some of those um, those thoughts and those techniques with me you know if, if I was uh, holding on to just a you know 20% of it I think it was beneficial so you know I want to thank uh, Megs uh, and again Girls Ride NC for putting everything together and uh, you know great great time this is all before lunch, so unfortunately, some of my footage from after lunch where we were doing some log hops and some other drills and stuff, um, yeah, I lost it. So I, I accidentally swapped cards and, and, and overrode, it, overrode it. But in any case, you know, uh, it, it was a good time, and uh, this is uh, definitely something that I would look forward to doing again. So hope you guys get out there, enjoy some of this nice warm weather we got coming our way. And ride a dirt bike. Let's accelerate once again. Signing off.